Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So you guys are probably wondering why I'm all up in your face like this right now, but it is because in today's video I am going to be pretty much talking to you guys all about winged liner. So this is pretty much winged liner 101, how I create my winged liner and um, I know a lot of people struggle with this for you know whatever the case may be a lot of people may find it difficult and I know this because I myself found it very difficult but this has been the way that I have actually been creating my winged liner for about a year now and I feel that this is the easiest way for me so I am going to be sharing this with you guys uh, because I do get a lot of people asking me how I create my winged liner and you know winged liner has been has become really popular over the last you know few years I mean it just pretty much completes a look it just makes you you know it can just make the most basic makeup look very very put together and very complete so you know like what they say less is more so I have already done this side away from camera so this is what we're pretty much gonna create on this side and for winged liner I mean pretty much what you need is a liquid liner or a liner pen which is what I'm going to be using today because I find it a lot easier for me to create the perfect wing with a an eyeliner pen so um, let's go ahead and get started. Let's get over the chit chat and you know get straight to the point. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is basically how I achieve it. So uh, you're pretty much gonna decide how far out you want your uh, wing to be. So I like mine to be really nice and subtle. Um, and so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna grab a mirror, okay, and. What I like to do first is I like to start with the wing. That's, you know, the very, very first step for me. So let's go ahead and I, I like to start from the corner of my eye. And I like to be quiet for this. So I may not speak a lot because I want it to be nice and straight. Anyway, okay, here we go. I'm gonna go right here. I'm gonna go upwards. Like that. And I'm pretty much gonna leave it alone now <laughs> okay so you have your wing that's kind of like the base of it you can say and then what I like to do is I like to go in the center and I like to bring it out here we go and then what I like to do like once you have that like once I get here I like to bring it a little bit up as you saw and then I like to come in here to the wing and then I'm gonna connect those two together I'm gonna bring it in so here we go. Just like that. Do you see that? And then like if you see like a little opening there, I just kind of like to complete that. Just like that. And you you know, you pretty it's it's really not that difficult. So I always like to start out with the little tail and go upwards. And then I like to go in the inner corner. like that and just kind of connect everything together and then I like to fill that out fill it in and get as close to the lash line as possible and there you go see missing a little spot there there you go and just kind of and, you know, and you can make it as thick as you want like if you want like really really sharp wings like you know that kind of just make you look like you're gonna like fly somewhere else and you can you know feel free to bring that baby all the way out here like if you feel like it you know do you um, but I personally like to have my wings like a little more subtle and yeah I mean and if you want to go thicker by all means go right ahead girl um, so yeah, uh, you would probably just, you know, make, bring this up and just, you know, make it thicker on the inside. And, and then if you, if you want to like make this fuller too. And yeah, so that is pretty much our winged liner. And I am going to go ahead and, uh, just finish the rest of my eye, like more eyeliner, like on my lash line and mascara. And I will be right back. 
All right, guys, so that is it for this video on how I achieve my perfect winged liner. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any future shenanigans that are to come. Thank you guys so much for watching again, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.